Hello, this video is about the filling gotcha that we recently, not discovered, but I've known about it. But I'm making this video also for myself as a reminder uh, because it took me a few tries to remember what fixed the problem. The problem is that on the insured, insured side, it comes up blank. And there is a gotcha in the system that makes it come up blank. And here's what I found that makes the insurance blank on any, almost any patient is that in the global settings, these are the settings that it needs to be because what happens is that this new feature that you're able to turn off some of those boxes in the encounter form. Well, you turn one of them that you turn off actually is linked to the billing, which is the billing facility. And the billing facility also contains the uh, is linked to the insurance. So if you don't have the billing facility, then the insurance won't populate. And that's all because one of the fields is turned off. In the screenshot that you that I have here, you can see where I have it like uh, on, off, on, off, on, off, on, off. These are, these are the features that needs to be set that way. By the way, let's go over here and jump in just as to make this video longer. I'm going to go to globals and I'm going to go down to form encounter and do what I'd said on that one. So hide that one. Cause like some people want to hide all of them. And I, I completely understand because it makes it the encounter form way bigger than it used to be in the past. And those that have legacy systems want to turn all that stuff off. So I'm going to save this. You already know what it looks like with them all turned on. So let's go jump into our test patients chart and let's see visit history so now if I go here then when I go to the ah, let me edit this this is what it looks like with those fields on and off these are the ones I know for sure have to be in there you can uh, figure out more closely which one act is exactly it is but I would guarantee is in between the this facility and the billing facility here between these two the POS code is if you have the POS turned on so that you can set the POS in the encounter but if you have that turn that feature turned off then of course this goes away on its own and the on on hmm, hospital date that one can go away too let me see because i'm pretty sure that one doesn't have anything to do with billing but i know that between these two here they have to be there and also the encounter provider should be there as well so those the three bottom on ones here just from uh, what i remember those three have to be there the pos code is optional and the onset hospital date is optional but I don't know if there's an option to turn that off. I'm looking in the encounters, but I don't see an option to turn off that encounter uh, hospital date. But anyway, definitely keep that bottom row. Talk to you later.